top test prep. Hi, my name is Krishna and I'm a tutor with Top Test Prep. Today I'd like to answer a very common question that many parents and students ask, which is what SAT scores do I need to get into an elite college? So there are two major factors that, that combine to determine this. The first is your own SAT goals. What this means is, is it your goal for the SAT score to be something that sets you apart from the pack, a real high accomplishment on your resume, or is it your goal simply to have an SAT score that doesn't disqualify you, that's good enough given the rest of your application to get you into school? A second major important consideration is what your academic and extracurricular profile is, because the score you need really depends on that. What this means is if you're the type of student who's marketing themselves as an academic superstar, you need to have high enough SAT scores to be consistent with that. If, on the contrary, you're the type of student who is instead marketing yourself as somebody who is extremely passionate about one of their extracurriculars, maybe you're an, ex an exemplary athlete, or maybe you're somebody who has a real volunteer passion, then oftentimes it's the case that you have something that offsets the need for an extremely high SAT score. So putting all this information together, if you're looking to get into a college like a Harvard, like an MIT, or like a Stanford, what sort of SAT scores do you need? Well, if you're the type of student who is looking to get an SAT score that's going to be a high accomplishment on their resume, that's going to set them apart from the pack, really the only SAT scores that are going to do that are scores that are perfect scores or near perfect scores. If you're the type of student who is an academic superstar that needs an SAT score that's consistent with that, then you're going to need something that might be in the range of uh, 2200 to lower 2300. If you're the type of student who has a very strong extracurricular passion that offsets the need for an extremely high SAT score, it's more okay to have an SAT score in the 2000 to 2100 range. So with that in mind, you can further do something which is research the specific college standards because it's important to look specifically at your own college which might have its own particular goals for the SAT. So don't just take my word for it, also do some further research. If you'd like more tips on how you can best prepare for your college admissions process, you can give us a call at 800-501-PREP or visit us at toptestprep.com.